Hey Psych2Goers, welcome back to another video. Before we start, we'd like to thank you for all the support you've given us. Psych2Go's mission is to help everyone learn psychology in a digestible manner. Now, let's begin. Depression is one of the most common mental illnesses in the world. It can make you lose all of your energy and motivation to do anything, and it can negatively impact your self-image, as well as your relationships with others. This is why it's so important to remember that you're not alone and that there is help and support for you if you need it. While seeking help and treatment is the first step to getting better, the road towards improvement may feel slow and difficult. How do you know that you're actually getting better? Every day may seem so similar to you that you can't really tell the difference. Don't worry. We here at Psych2Go have prepared a list of seven surprising signs that your mental health is getting better. Before we begin, we would like to mention that this video is created for educational purposes only and is not intended to substitute a professional diagnosis. If you suspect you may have depression or any mental health condition, we highly advise you to seek help from a qualified mental health professional. Number one, less irritability. Have you noticed that you've become more patient? One of the symptoms of depression is irritability. You may easily blow up in other people's faces or you find even the smallest tics to be exasperating. This is because irritability often accompanies depression since it's a manifestation of your internalized feelings of frustration and helplessness. So a sign that you're getting better is when you find yourself more tolerant and patient than before. Number two, hygiene and grooming. Are there any changes to your personal hygiene? One of the signs that you're getting better has to do with your grooming. It may be imperceptible at first, but one day you may notice that you look better. Your skin has its usual radiance back and your eyes are not so sullen. It's not a change that happens overnight, but a product of you slowly coming back to yourself. Number three, tackling chores you once put off. Have you started to go through your list of chores that you've put off for so long? Often when you're depressed, you feel tired and fatigued. This lack of energy and motivation to do anything may cause many of your plans to take a back seat. Therefore, if you find yourself ticking tasks off your to-do list more and more lately, then it may be a sign that you're improving and getting better. Number four, interest in activities. Have you started drawing or dancing again? Another sign of improvement is when you start getting back into your hobbies and interests. When depressed, you may find yourself too tired and demotivated to do any of the things you used to enjoy. Your motivation for hobbies, social activities, and goals may decline. Therefore, a sign that your mental health is getting better is when you start to feel excited and motivated to get back to your interests. Number five, changes in appetite. Have you started eating more lately? Maybe less? Changes in your appetite may mean your mental health is getting better. If you've experienced a loss of appetite when you were in a depressed state, a sign of improvement may be to suddenly find food more appealing and to gain a better appetite. On the other hand, if you've noticed that you've developed a tendency to binge eat when you were depressed, finding more self-control and restraint when it comes to food may be the sign of improvement. Number six, improved concentration. Are you able to focus on your work longer? Depression affects your executive functioning, particularly your ability to make decisions and concentration. Though antidepressants are prescribed to patients with severe depression, studies have shown that it does not improve executive functioning or other cognitive skills, but only helps to improve mood. On the other hand, with problem-solving treatment and cognitive behavioral therapy, you may begin to notice an improvement with your concentration and decision-making abilities. And number seven, better self-image. Have you become kinder and gentler with yourself? One of the cruelest aspects of depression is that it impacts your view of yourself by magnifying your imperfections and making you believe that you're worthless, incompetent, or not good enough. In turn, these negative thoughts keep you in a depressed cycle. But as you begin to reconnect and to have compassion towards yourself, your self-worth will increase, which will allow you to see yourself in a better light. Though it may not feel like it at the moment, depression does not last forever. If you found this video helpful, be sure to like and share this video with those who might benefit from it. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button and notification bell icon to get notified whenever Psych2Go posts a new video. The references and studies used in this video are added in the description below. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one.